I know this sounds ridiculous, but I was actually on AEW. If you guys didn't know, AEW released a game on the mobile phones, cellular devices, it's called the AEW Elite General Manager game. They held an invitational tournament for this game, eight wrestlers, eight content creators, and I was one of the content creators. And I actually ended up winning the whole tournament. If you guys would like to watch my games from the tournament, you can head over to the AEW Games YouTube channel and check that out. You can watch me face all the content creators on my side of the bracket, all the way to the finals where I faced off against Orange Cassidy. Also something that just sounds ridiculous. And I'm sure most of you guys that go here know that I run a professional wrestling brand called Deadlock. But if you are new here, or maybe you saw the video and recommended, God forbid YouTube actually recommends this to somebody. Now you also know that I run a brand called Deadlock, but you already know. But anyways, Deadlock also has a flagship podcast where I talked about not only me winning the tournament, but the trip to AEW and everything that was involved with it in detail. Maybe I think for like 30 or something minutes. I'll have a link down in the description if you guys would like to listen to that. In this video, I just wanted to keep it abridged. I thought it would just be a fun YouTube video to make and talk to you guys. Maybe for people that didn't know and now you know. So for winning said tournament, I ended up getting two prizes. The first prize was a custom-made, one-of-a-kind AEW championship. And the second thing, even more ridiculous than that, was that I got to book an AEW match, book an AEW match on AEW Dark Elevation. Not only book that match, but also be involved in that match. So first things first, let me show you guys the championship. The AEW Elite General Manager Invitational Tournament Champion. It is a three plate belt, two side plates, one main plate. It was created by Belts by Dan, which you guys might also know as the creator of the current IWGP Championship. I believe he also made the TNT Championship, or at least the one that Miro is using right now on TV. So this is a very legit belt. And now for the second thing, getting to book a match on Dark Elevation. I got to cut a promo with Alex Marvez, like an interview gimmick, which is as ridiculous as it sounds. Kevin, let me get that footage rolled. This is Alex Marvez, and I'm here with James, the winner of the Elite General Manager Invitational Tournament. And James, you have a distinct honor for being our champion. You get to pick Lee Johnson's opponent tonight here on AEW Dark Elevation. And if Lee wins, he will be getting a TNT Championship match against Miro coming up August 3rd in Jacksonville at homecoming on Daly's Place. You had a list of wrestlers to choose from. Who's it going to be? Oh, man, that's a loaded question. This is an unreal matchup here that I have uh, planned out. So there's a guy that I know, I've been watching him for a long time, up and down Japan, Kawasaki Stadium, 40,000 fans. He's a freak of nature, man, and it's Luther. Wow, so it's going to be Luther against Lee Johnson. That's going to be an outstanding match here tonight on AEW Dark Elevation. But first, I want to bring in Aubrey Edwards here. And of course, James, you didn't just get to pick a match for winning our tournament. You get something else. Hey, James, again, hey. thank you so much for participating in our tournament, being awesome at the game. And as the winner of the tournament, I'm awarding you with this wonderful custom Elite General Manager Invitational Tournament belts. So this is yours to keep, yours to show off on your stream, oh, rub it in everyone's face, how good you are to Elite General Manager. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you both. Yep. And you too can play Elite General Manager. Download it on iOS and Android phones. This is Alex Marvez signing off. And not only did I get to do an interview with Alex Marvez and Aubrey Edwards, but I also got to be a part of the match they ended up booking. They wanted somebody to face Lee Johnson, and there was nobody else in my head that could have worked other than Luther and Serpentica. So I'm going to show you footage from the match, which includes Paul White, Eddie Kingston, and Tony Schiavone talking about me, which is... Like I said, man, I really don't know a word better than ridiculous for all this. If you'd like to see the full match, you can check out AEW's YouTube channel. Hey, Kevin, roll the footage! And one of those fans who won, James Darnell, picked this matchup. He wanted to see Luther in the ring. And Tony Khan is allowing the tournament winner to book the opponent for this man, Lee Johnson. I kind of like what they're doing with the game tie-in. Let the fans be part of it. Pivotal match like this in a young man's career like big Johnny Lee Johnson. There's a lot on the line for having some guy that's got no real booking experience influence the shots. So there he is. There was the general manager yep. who picked Luther as Big Shotty's opponent. Is he the one giving out the paydays? Later. I don't know, but you know, hey, you got to have that check at the end of the match. <laughs> James Darnell, the all elite general, AEW elite general manager. Really abuses Serpentico. Yeah, well, you know, after a while, I used to feel bad for Serpentico, but after this much, I kind of figure, like, dude must be okay with it. Boy, that's right in front of James Darnell. How about that? James Darnell, that's a highlight getting a high five yes, from sir. this guy. 
Look at this, though. This is cool. This is cool. Why is he? Did he just wipe his hand? He sure did. Well, that's a fan experience he won't forget. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can All we get right? Yeah, that just. Uh, it just got weird here. I yeah. told you it'd get weird. It gets real weird here. Anytime Luther's in the ring, it is weird. Once again, just to let you know, Tony Khan allowed the winner of the tournament to book Lee Johnson's opponent, and he booked Luther. I tell you right now, I'm gonna get on that next time, so I can I can book uh, a match. Ooh. Well, James Darnell, all of the general manager. Do not forget. What is this? Oh, here he is. Is this on the sheet? What's going on here? So I mean, hey, that happened. An unbelievable night. I'll never forget it. It's genuinely one of the coolest things that I've ever been able to do. I want to give a shout out to Aubrey Evers real quick who kind of overlooked this whole thing. She was fantastic. I'm glad that we were able to become friends with this. She's just the coolest. Also, shout out to Shane, Crystallized Games, everybody else that helped out with this tournament. And this was really dope. And also just a shout out to everyone who's been kicking it with me since day one. And you too, even if you just joined me. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I hope that you guys did enjoy. Remember, if you did, leave a thumbs up in the comments so YouTube will show this video to somebody. And I'll check you guys out next time when we come up with something else. See you.